John, I've just been told from a U.S. law enforcement official that they are saying it is evident that this is a terrorist-related attack. And uh, among the key targets, key people that they're looking at is Osama bin Laden. It was just last Friday that the U.S. State Department put out a worldwide caution to American citizens traveling abroad and also to U.S. government facilities. And they said that terrorism knows no limits, whether it's on U.S. soil or outside. So they're certainly looking at that as a possibility. What I'm also hearing from my uh, officials at FAA, at the Federal Aviation Administration, is that they believe the first plane may have been an American Airlines plane, a commercial jet, either a 737 or 757, and that it was a hijacked plane. This is what they believe. They're still trying to get this verified, but they did get some reports that there was an American Airlines plane that was hijacked en route from Boston to Los Angeles this morning. And they're saying that there is a strong possibility that that first plane that crashed into one of the towers, which does appear to be commercial and looking at the video, they're saying it appears to be either a 737 or 757, that that apparently might have been the hijacked plane. In terms of what the second plane is, they said that that does appear, as you've been reporting, John, to be a jet plane, probably a 737, a twin-engine jet airplane. Um, and those are the two things that are being looked at. They said at this point, there was no direct threat that they were aware of, of any specific threat in terms of targeting the Twin Towers there in New York, but that they did have specific threats against Americans and American facilities around the world, and that's why they issued that worldwide caution.